Hi everyone, today I'd like to give you a quick update on my hydrogen generator and compressor unit, which improve gas quality and safety. So the first improvement is this uh, cylinder of silica gel, which absorbs the moisture in the hydrogen. So the hydrogen will be more pure and also they won't get any water into the compressor because I already ruined three compressors before. So, but now it's completely gone and you can see in the top that this top layer already absorbed quite an amount of moisture. This is from three cubic meters of hydrogen, more or less. So it will take quite a while before it's completely saturated with water. And then of course I can heat it up and let the water evaporate and use it again. The second feature is this tube here with all these valves which makes it possible to see if there's coming only hydrogen from this side and therefore if the separation still works properly. So to do that I will place this soap bubble maker over the hose and I catch the bubble like so and I'll then ignite it. So as you heard there was no bang so no oxygen. So that's the first checking point, so now on to the next. I will open this valve so it can flow into the silica gel tube. And I'll close this one, so now the gas flows in here. And it comes out the other end. As you can see here, I have the same valve with the tube. So I'll do the same thing here, but now I just shut the other valve. So probably will only be oxygen here, so I need to wait a while, but let's do a little test. Need to build a little pressure. Mostly hydrogen already. So till this point, we're good to go. So the bag is filling right now. For the first time, I will fill it halfway, and then I will just blow off the first bag because there could be a little bit of oxygen mixed within it. So let's start her up. So now the bag is emptied, I will attach the hose again, but of course in this hose will also be oxygen, so I will also blow off the first bit of that. I also installed this pressure regulator and if I open the valve, a very small amount of gas will flow out of here, so I can always check if the gas that's going into the tank is pure hydrogen. So there won't be any danger of any tanks exploding. So I have a bubble again. If I light it and it goes slowly, then it's okay. Flying hydrogen bubbles. This is of course all a very low tech solution, but it works for now. I'm planning on making an oxygen sensor or some electrical way to measure the amount of oxygen in the hydrogen, but that's another experiment. Also I use this anti-foaming agent, uh, because if I don't add it, the sodium hydroxide solution will foam up until it bubbles all out, which makes a big mess. I just uh, refilled it with a little bit of water, so I think I need to add a little bit again because it's foaming it a little bit, but it's okay for now. Okay, that's it everyone. Thanks for watching. Please like, share and subscribe. Check me out on Facebook and Instagram. And also check out the channel of Ian Builder. He does all kinds of weird experiments, also with hydrogen. So go check those out and see you next time.